went on a date once. It was the day before Valentine's Day. He kissed me, and then he said, that was not as magical as I thought it was going to be. He was super rich, and his um, butler, literally <laughs> his butler, <laughs> was there the entire time, but in a different movie theater, and right. he took him, and he left, and I was stuck there. No one told me that they were, like, going to leave. There's this guy that I really liked. He told me we were going to go for dinner. He was like, my um, dad is at dinner. He's with, like, ten of his friends. We pull up and it's his dad and his mom in a booth alone. And he was like, no, it's both of my parents and they really want to meet you. It was the most uncomfortable dinner of my life. I went on this date once, took me to a party, went out into the smoking area with this boy, and he starts kissing another girl. I just watch him kiss this other girl, and I'm uh, just they're like, is, is this happening? Is this happening? <laughs> okay, brilliant. So I'm gonna go get my jacket. <laughs> I did go out with this guy one time. We went out to go get crepes or something, and on, on the receipt, the waitress had written, your girl is like sunshine. And he like looked at it and was like, <sighs> and I was like, what's wrong? He was like, I just don't know why nobody thinks I'm the sunshine. And I was like, what? I went on a date. I thought, you know, maybe he, he's in my town. So I'll like just treat him because I'm a woman and I got my own money. The bank was closed and my card got declined. Anyways, he saved the day and he came through. He became a gentleman and he was just like, don't even worry about it. That's the man you need in your life. <laughs>